A very difficult match to predict the outcome of. The best defence in the league taking on the freest scoring side in the division. Who will prevail? Stay with us on EA TV. Hello everyone and welcome. Our footballing travels have taken us to the Midlands. We're at Villa Park. My name's Derek Ray and delighted to have alongside me, as usual on these occasions, Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. What might we see today, Stuart? Well, Derek, we can talk about coaches and their methods, but it's now down to the players. Which ones are going to stand out? Who will affect the game? And who will have the... Oh, he's through here! Well, just look at this. Magnificent agility, perfect timing and great connection. What a goal that is. So the ball rolling again with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Douglas Luiz. Diego Carlos. Well, sometimes we look for an explanation and just can't find one, but the truth of the matter is Liverpool in position. Well, fantastic reflex action. One terrific save after another. And a textbook interception. Ramsey Look at Dinia. And now this is Longley Regained possession Longley Look at Dinia. They do pass the ball with authority. But then the commentator's curse comes into play. Teammates available. Great opportunity. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Delivering it into the box. Able to deal with the threat. Ball is loose. High quality defending. And it's going to be a Villa throw. Douglas Luiz. Well, they have the ball once more. Moving into the advanced position. Buendia. Diego Carlos. Emiliano Buendia. Unable to keep the ball that time. They'll be disappointed with the way that attack ended. Look at Dinia. Jacob Ramsey. A chopping challenge. And the referee has got to have a big think about it. Well, the card is out. And it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card.
Douglas Luiz. Perfect tackle. Incisive pass. Hakimi. It's with Douglas Luiz. Pavlidis. Evangelos Pavlidis. Buendia. Buendia. Still trying to make something happen. Oh, it was there for him to get them on level terms. Well, that's a big miss. That should have been the equaliser there. Frederiksen. Antoine. And a bad pass it was. Douglas Luiz. Oh, big chance! Well, without wanting to put too fine a point on it, that goes down as a tame effort and easy for the keeper. Determined defending. Hakimi. And plenty of scope to be creative. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out any sign of danger. <laughs> and delivered into the box. A decisive clearance it was. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. What was the chance they could get caught out on the break here? Can they keep it going? Ground to make up, and perhaps this corner can assist them. Substitution time it is here. Well, these fans have had to be patient. Could this be the equaliser? Who can he pick out? Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Another corner. <laughs> Trying to deliver it accurately. Oh, you don't want to lose the ball in that position. And the first half is in the history books now, here at Villa Park. We certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point, Stuart. Well, it's been a really good display for him so far, Derek. He scored the leading goal, he's been energetic, and his movement has caused lots of problems to this back line. Can he keep it going in the second half, though? Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in the second half. An inability to keep hold of the ball there. And it's with Davis. Options in the middle. He can't hold on to it. Well, no problems defensively. Well, that save just about keeps them in this. But they have to pose more of a threat at the other end. Well, it was a splendid piece of goalkeeping, but he has to remain on his toes. Well, we always enjoy bringing you live action on EA TV and Premier League action coming up. It's Aston Villa facing Wolves. That looks a really entertaining game. Two good teams with two excellent coaches. I can't wait for that one to come round. And the referee says penalty. And the substitution will occur now.
Chance to equalise here. And he finds the net. No to the gutties and counter. Well, here it is again. And just watch the keeper. He stands still, hoping it's hit down the middle. Unfortunately for him, he's got it wrong. So underway again, following the goal that made things level. Douglas Luiz. It's with Camara. Tielemans. Pavlidis. And they know they need to stop him. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? And they're making a change. And a goal! Almost bewitching in its beauty! Excellent technique! Well, I think that shows what a good rapport he has with the players. Well, let's look at this again. It's a great bit of skill because he has to get both topspin and side spin on the ball at the same time. Look how much Bendy gets on that. Excellent goal. Well, frustration for the manager. She needs to get a reaction from her players now. And the ball is moving again. Anyone's guess how this is going to finish? 2-1 currently. could level it and it is the equaliser parity now and who's to say what's going to happen next well here's the replay watch how he goes past his man with such ease and it's just a change of pace and his movement's so clever once he gets onto it there's only one thought in his head smash it as hard as possible what a good goal. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Evangelos Pavlidis. Douglas Luis. Watkins. It's with Douglas Luiz. Tielemans. Shot attempted. Determined defending. And a quick reminder, we have plenty of live football oh, in. Oh, big chance here, Derek. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. And support available. That's a nice looking ball. Well, it looked as though he was going to net another one, but the keeper getting in the way. Well, that was a decent chance for his second there. Not the finish he was really looking for. And the deflection there before it went over the byline. Going to be a corner. Good work from Villa to win it back. taken away he won the ball well I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Bournemouth game Alex Scott can fill us in
Yeah, it's a third goal for Manchester City. They're ahead by three now with 76 minutes played. Many thanks, Alex. Just wanted to get it out of there. Well, that's the sign of a well-organised defence. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. And he's in. And a goal! In the lead again. Fully deserved. Well, here it is again. And the pace in which they break forward is devastating. It's so hard to defend against. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Ollie Watkins. He's in here. Oh, he's given us away inexplicably. Oh, that's... Can he put it away? And a goal! Another one! Two in quick succession. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. So the current scoreline, 4-2. And so into the final five minutes. Hakimi. Now with Diego Carlos. Well, the final whistle approaching, and this has certainly been an away day to remember. Stuart, your assessment. Well, I think the scoreline reflects the difference between the two teams. For most of the game, they've dictated the play and they've created some really good chances. I think it's been an excellent performance. Longley, possession one. Well, wait, don't go anywhere. We're go in position, and there it is. That will put the seal on victory if there were any lingering doubts. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb. And then through on goal, he just goes for power and smashes it past the keeper. There's no stopping that. What a great finish. Bubakar Kamara. And now this is Longley. Douglas Luiz. On to Diego Carlos. They've regained possession. And so the referee blows for full time and it goes down as a victory for the visitors. Well, Derek, they were the better team all over the pitch. We saw good individual performances. We saw an attack which was always threatening and they played really well. What a performance that was today. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, what more could you ask for? His build-up play was clever, his movement was dynamic, and he scored a couple of goals. What a player he is.